where you'll be making your World Championships debut. Just tell me what that means to you personally. Um, honestly, it's like one of the best feelings ever because um, since I was a little child, <laughs> I've always wanted to come to World Championships and it's kind of surreal to think I'm actually here now. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited and really looking forward to it to finally like, tick off one of the things on my list. Yeah. We're here in Dubai for holding camp. It's posing challenges, isn't it, for everyone in terms of acclimatising to the heat? You're working on final tweaks before um, Doha, so tell me what you've been doing this week. Um, so we've just started getting into training, so gradually getting into it. Um, like the first day, I've just been doing tempos and just sort of just acclimatising to the heat because um, I'm not a fan of the heat, so it's been a bit difficult. Um, but we're getting through it. I had a hard session this week and it's been, yeah, but it's been good. Yeah, I guess the only way you get used to it is by experiencing it and yeah. putting yourself through it. Is that Definitely. how you're seeing it? I guess it's probably the way you're trying to sort of get through yeah, it. Yeah, right? I just have to jump right in. <laughs> Yeah. I think you're coming into a really successful relay team, aren't you? One that's mm. sort of it's broken the US to make a hold on the event in the last few years. So, so what's the environment like that you come into here in terms of the four body team? I think we've got a really strong team, um, and having the mix now, we've got something different. And I think everyone's going to really put in a lot of effort just to get those relay teams right because we want to get medals in both. Um, so I think we've got a really strong team, a really good bunch of girls. I'm really excited, just yeah, just to get on and do it. To the group. Oh gosh, <laughs> is it alright if I, I pause? Uh, yeah. Oh, okay, sorry. What do you mean? What I just mean, what, what's, your, what's your role in the group? I oh guess you've seen a bit of a newcomer. What do you, what do you kind of, what do you bring? I don't know how to answer that question. Um, I don't know. <laughs> That's that question. Do you think maybe a new face that brings a bit of energy to the group and kind of just freshens things up a little bit? I'm going to go with that, yeah. So, um, yeah, I guess I'm still pretty new to the team. Um, and four by more well, fours aren't really my main event, but I guess I bring that something different because I do run the twos. But having um, a 200 meter runner in one four by four, I think it's something good, something different. Yeah. And in terms of the season as a whole, how do you how do you assess it? Pardon. Your season as a whole, how do you feel it's gone? Um, I guess it could have been. Oh, God. It's okay. Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Just like you know, that wasn't great, but um, okay. Sorry, yeah. Sh okay. Yeah. How's the season gone as a whole? Um, it hasn't been ideal, but I'm really grateful to be here and really grateful to be given the opportunity to run here and in Doha. Um, so I'm just really excited to start and show what I can do because I feel like I'm really getting into it right now, even though it's quite late in the season. But I feel like I'm ready to show my potential. Yeah, you've competed quite a lot, haven't you, across mm -hmm. once and two. Do you think that sort of helped keep you kind of keep your eye in and sort of be used to competing ahead of this major championships? Yeah, definitely. Um, it's been such a long season for, ev for everybody, to be fair. Um, but I guess doing something different for me is quite nice um, to like end on a 4x4 because it is something different because I've just been doing ones and twos all s most of the season. So ending a 4x4 is quite nice, yeah. Perfect. Just finally, what does it mean to you to wear that GB vest at World Championships and, and how will you look back on this experience? Um, it's always on. I know ev everyone says it too fair, but it is generally like a dream to put in your GB vest and re represent your country. Like this is all I've been dreaming of as a child. So to be actually able to be at the World Championships and to finally do that is just amazing.